On the EMI platform, you can find a wide range of different vehicles, from starting from the ID3, a very small car, up to the ID uh, bus, you can see here. Um, you have a lot of scale effects regarding that platform. For example, we use the same uh, driver assistance functionalities in all of these cars. Uh, and on the other hand, you can have a, a platform with uh, axles set far apart to ensure showed overhangs. Yeah, autonomous driving is um, for a lot, of people, a lot of people something like pie in the sky. Uh, but I can tell you it's much closer uh, than you might think. We will start here in Hamburg in 2025 with our first ride-sharing um, ride sharing mobility service together with Moya. And for this, we are already on the road today. We are driving here in Hamburg and Munich with our cars to develop and to see how these cars should look like. Ja, die Markteinführung startet bereits Ende September in Deutschland, direkt nach der IAA in Hannover. Und die anderen Märkte folgen dann Schritt für Schritt. We are happy that the market introduction starts already in September. We will start in the market Germany and the other markets will follow step by step. Volkswagen Commercial Vehicles is completely programmed for growth. During the introduction of our new multivan, we already explained our new strategy. The right microbus for every customer group. So we have the T6.1 for our commercial customers with combustion engine, the T7 as hybrid and combustion engine version for our private customers, and the ID bus for electrified driving. A complete range of vehicles for our customers. To create the ID bus as the next generation of T1, it was very important to create one iconic design again as the T1 was. And of course it is not easy, but we done it all to make it sure that it happened. The simple shape, you know, the, the strong, timeless design, but as well the strong, sympathetic character. I think this was the beginning of, of create this big icon. As always, we're starting first with the dream. As uh, we saw it on the show car, we had it already vision. And the vision, we can say proudly, we managed to get it in reality. Maybe the Buddha, you know, which was at the front, floating in the, in the uh, dashboard area, is something what we took off. But therefore, we came with some another very surprise uh, Easter eggs, what you will find it later on. And I think you will enjoy it. What it makes ID Bus very special is, his, is the shape. The shape is very simple and it's very strong. And it works perfectly as icon, people mover, but as well the shape allowed us to make perfect iconic cargo. And this is something what it proved that iconic means not only beauty, but it means as well excellent functionality. Or it can at least mean. And in the way of ID Bus, it works by both very, 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 very good. Yes, truly, I have a Samba 23 window bus uh, that I love to drive. Um, it's a, a, a true classic car. Now, what do I expect that car to be when the ID bus is out and about? Uh, it has to uh, carry its genes, its DNA, but of course, it also has to be part of our transformation. The transformation into battery electric vehicle, into digitalization, uh, it will be over the air updatable. Uh, the car will be a true icon and the face in the crowd. There's nothing like it out there, just like its predecessor decades ago. So carry those values, those virtues, um, and transform it into something that carries us into the future. This is what I expect from the ID bus. Yeah, first of all, of course, the T1, uh, our Samba bus, the bully, the ID bus uh, in the future has got a, a cult status. It's an icon of the brand. It's a face that is truly just VW. Nobody else can take that spot. Um, and if you, uh, like me, I lived in the United States for five years, and three out of these five years, I had my 23 window Samba bus in Atlanta as my daily drive at weekends. Um, picking up people from the airport and the positive feedback you get from that car just shows the potential of the car emotionally. And now we take that car that is emotionally so strong associated with peace and happiness uh, into the future with a battery electric vehicle helping us write that story way to zero. Of course, there's a huge potential. Now, United States, they will have to be patient. 
will need another two years on the car until the car is actually on the streets. Uh, but people are eagerly waiting for that car, and I can promise you it will be a slam dunk uh, for people uh, because they've been waiting for generations for the T1 to be succeeded. So what do people expect from the ID bus? Of course, it has to be true to its original. Uh, the original, of course, you had a higher seating position, you had a nice overview, it was spacious, it had character. All this has to be part of the future personality of that car. Its identity has to be the same, and the first feedback we have from journalists actually reflects on that. They actually say it's wonderful to drive it around, it's got that kick you get from the MEB, so the electric kick, instant torque. Uh, you get the spacious, the roominess in the car, uh, the seating position is great. Uh, and, of course, you get um, the appeal uh, and the aura you have driving around, people giving you the thumbs up. And, of course, we want many people to do that in the future. Both studies, the ID bus and the ID bus cargo, have been very well received by the audience worldwide. We are now presenting the production version of both models, ready for market launch. At the same time, we are producing the T6 and the new multivan at the Hannover plant, which are based on another platform. So we are talking about a high level of complexity in logistics and production. I'm very proud that we at Volkswagen Commercial Vehicles have mastered this great challenge because we have an outstanding team and best-in-class competencies. Both studies, the ID bus and the ID bus cargo, have been very well received by the audience worldwide. We are now presenting the production version of both models, ready for market launch. At the same time, we are producing the T6 and the new multivan at the Hannover plant, which are based on another platform. So we are talking about a high level of complexity in logistics and production. I am very proud that we at Volkswagen Commercial Vehicles have mastered this great challenge because we have an outstanding team and best-in-class competencies. The next step is to expand the ID bus program. Different battery sizes for different customer needs, additional drive concepts, further variants, a longer wheelbase and even an ID California. You see, we still have a lot of dreams and ambitions. For us in color and trim, it was very important to use sustainable materials, such as recycled PET bottles, for example, and you can find them in the ceiling and in the carpet and also on the seats. And another thing that I have to admit that we are really proud on is the animal-free steering wheel that we put into the car. And the ID bus is the first one in the whole VW world that has this. And, um, yes, another thing I can expose is the very friendly, life-affirming interior. Everything appears so light. The seats are colorful, nice and cozy. The touch is very soft. And yes, that's the heart of color and trim. For the ID bus, we have chosen a variety of very positive and bright colors. We have seven of them that you can choose a monochrome paint or bicolor painting. And the first one that I need to pick out is the lemon yellow that we have already shown on the 2017 motor show. So everybody will recognize this car. And you can find the color also in the doors and on the instrumental panel, in the fabrics, so we have a perfect harmony, and that's a really friendly environment. Then you can choose um, an orange, a green, a blue, that makes everything very positive and, yeah, funny. <laughs> We have a lot of favorite details in the ID bus that I can talk about, but I think the most important one is the sustainability. It's the first car at Volkswagen that has so many surfaces made from recycled PET bottles, for example. And also the steering wheel is made from non-animal surfaces. Another thing that's a perfect color and trim thing maybe is the color, and we have so many colors that we can offer to the customer. We have a yellow, a green, and an orange, and they all fit perfect to the exterior color. Then, again, if you talk about details, I have to mention the diamond that you can find on the exterior and also in the interior. 
So, yes, I think the whole car is so friendly and full of little details, and we can see that we all work perfectly together, exterior designers, interior, and color and trim.